I'd be lying if I didn't feel like a little bit of a hipster listening to this album. Just a little, at least a little babby bit. All of ways, anti-socialites. Just like deadites. Yeah, groovy. First things first. It's a good album. I'm not gonna lie. I really love their first album, by the way. I think that album is a little better than this album in some aspects, but I also think this is a more fleshed out album and it feels like they had a full idea and range and they were ready to execute it. It has a good solid 10 track listing on here with easy to grasp concepts in each of these songs, mostly have been dealing with relationships and of course life in general and you feel like you kind of jump into her shoes in some of these songs. And Dream Pop is just always a, always had a soft spot for it, even if it sounds a little flashy or if it sounds a little bit escape-esque, it just, it's a good escape. And seriously, listen to this album with some headphones, it sounds very relaxing at times and sometimes it has a little more of a rough edge, especially when you get the guitar work really playing in there. Dreams Tonight was the song that kind of hooked me on this album, I was just like, it's so cute, it's a cute song. Like, if I saw you on the street, would I have you in my dreams tonight? It just, there's something about that. And it's just, uh, it really, imagine, I just, I'm weird, I guess. But I imagine two hipsters falling in love. That, I know, that's kind of, it's, yeah. But honestly, in this 10 track listing, I have no problems with it. Absolutely nothing bad to say about any of it. I feel like this is an easy album to check out. I recommend you do, and I'm definitely gonna put some of these songs in my set list. Gonna sneak them in there. Just gonna sneak them in in my DJ set list, because I highly, highly enjoyed this album. This is definitely a 7 out of 10. Sorry if these, like, reviews are really short, but honestly, I, some of these albums I just don't have a lot to say about. I feel like this is just kind of one of those albums that once you listen to it, you understand it. You fully understand the album and what it's doing. And it doesn't really need to be talked about, like, even more. It doesn't need to be, like, fully looked into because, yeah, it does have the guitar. It does have the drums. And everything's mixed very nicely. And her voice is just very mosey. But it works. It works so well with the album. And just check it out. It's, it's good. But anyways, I hope you enjoyed this short video. And have a good one. I'm glad to be kind of back. Peace.